Hey everyone, happy Wednesday. Hi. I always smile right when we change the camera and it zooms in on mom's face. So then you just don't see me smiling, but you see her glasses. <laughs> it always likes my head. I don't it know does. why. I, I, I do not know why. I think we start every video like this. We I do. Just, you think we would solve it one day, but we can't. <sighs> Uh, hi, I'm Kayla. I'm Nancy. For Stamping Before Anything Else, also known as Stamping Bay. We're a mother-daughter crafting team that likes to laugh and craft. And today we're going to be making some fun gifts. Gifts? I don't know where that word came from. Some fun uh, handmade cards using the hand-penned uh, designer series paper. Yes, and I can't decide on a stamp set, so I just grabbed a couple of them and we'll go... You guys can help me pick it out mm -hmm. later. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we got lots of, um, last week when we did our, our live, um, it was requested that we show you guys these fun folds. Look at the camera when you're talking. Um, they can't see the Okay, yeah, yeah. I was just moving, I'm okay. sorry. Yeah. Okay. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and use those. I thought you were down on the table, so. No. Now we are. Okay. Okay, there you go. There we are. <laughs> Okay, so um, so we're going to make this fun fold right here, um, and it's got this locking on here, and it opens up like that. As requested from last week. Yes, and so this die right here is actually retired, so um, this is no longer available. Um, and then we're also going to be using um, designer series paper and making this fun fold here. So we're going to be using the hand pen designer series paper for both of them. And we're actually going to start with, I think we're going to do this one first. Now, before we get started, though, I wanted to show you guys, we made this card together last week. And um, after you, we went live, Abby made a suggestion to put the back behind here. And I'm like, hello, that makes so much sense. So, <laughs> you know, um, it, it looks so much better with the bat. And it, and it folds up really nice right inside here. So, um, yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys because um, we did do this together. Hi, Bernie. Um, we did do this together. And, um, yeah, I don't know. I still love it. It's so gosh darn cute. All right. So, what we're going to need... Right here, um, I went and wrote down the measurements. Um, our base is going to be five and a half by eight and a half. You're going to score at two and a quarter and six and three eighths. Now, what I did is I put it in, I measured two and a quarter in, did my score line, and then for some reason on our scoreboard that we have, or not scoreboard, um, where I do my cut, uh, scoring, all the, the measurements that I needed were right in here right in the middle and it's kind of hard to see so what I did is I just took I scored and then I turned it and scored at two and an eighth on each end okay and that should create your gatefold like that all right I found him yay Kayla's gonna try and catch our kitty little baby oh I got him Yay, Kayla's got her baby, and her hair is all <laughs> and over And my hair him. is all over the place. Our camera is being really slow, so if it doesn't sync up. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Hi, say hello. He he doesn't care. He's over it. He is just like, go, go, go. <laughs> he wants to play. <gasps> oh, no, as you can see. Wow. <laughs> nice cat. <laughs> this is Charlie. This He's is Charlie. Super tiny. Oh, my gosh. He's such um, a love bug, but he likes to go. And uh, we found out he's kind of a bully. He is a bully. He is a little bully. Other cats. But he does like to snuggle. He doesn't look like it right now because he's in a new space. He hasn't been down here yet, really, to explore. Yep. Um, but you he guys, does like he to is snuggle. adorable. He is just a sweetheart. Yeah, he's really sweet. Yep, so. he's already. Oh, you didn't get his nose clean. No, I have to get a, a tissue, uh, not a tissue, a wet. We have to towel. wash his face. Yeah. But anyway, yeah, we got him Thursday night, and then he didn't eat for 24 hours, and we tried everything. <laughs> He's just a wiggle worm. Stop it. <laughs> and so we had to get canned tuna and give him, syringe feed him the tuna juice. To, oh, poor baby. To so let him run some energy off, and then yeah. we'll get him back okay, up we'll here. Back. Um, <laughs> yeah, so he wasn't eating any of the food that we were offering him, so, um, but we were very happy he was able to, um, get his food. 
so yeah, yeah he's been eight. fun. He's good. A lot of fun, but yeah, he. We're still trying to get him acclimated to our big boys. Um, right now, the big boys just look at him and hiss. Yeah. Um, Max is currently sleeping on my bed right now, and unaware. He has, he has no idea that the kitten is down here. Yep, <laughs> unaware that the kitten is here. So, okay. So for this card, as you can see, we open it up like this. So I'm going to start with the inside. We're going to take the inside piece, which measures four by five and a quarter, and we're just going to adhere that down. Green is not one of my colors, so I'm thinking outside the box. I could always use this side, but I kind of like this pattern. So we're going to go ahead and use our tape and get that measure. Whoop. Let me grab my ruler before I lose it, because I thought I lost it. Lost well, it. She lost it. I lost it. She lost it. <laughs> I thought I lost it the other day. Okay, so we're just going to adhere this. Now I'm trying to look to see if this makes a difference. I don't know. I don't think it does. I don't think it does either. So we're just going to put that on the inside, like so. Oh, there he goes. All right. Never know now where one he's of these at. is for a scrap, but I've already cut out my scrap piece. So this piece right here, I'm going to turn this over again. This piece, piece, capiche. <laughs> this <laughs> this piece measures three by four. And if you want, we can go ahead and stamp beforehand, but I really don't know what I'm going to do for the, the saying on the inside yet, so I'm just going to adhere it um, for now, just to put it in the inside. And we will have um, measurements up. I know lately we've been just kind of slacking on that, but we're going to get those up for you. Oh, goodness me. Wow, what was that? Um, oh, he's back there. I don't know. That was weird. He just like cried. Oh, is he gonna go? He's gonna go potty. I think. Oh no! <laughs> he totally is. Is he going potty? <laughs> he totally is. Or is he just sitting there? No, he's going potty. We're just gonna let that go. He's on a bag. He's so. on a plastic bag. But wow, seriously. Okay, you better yeah. grab him. Okay. <laughs> Are you sure he's going potty? He totally went potty. Yeah, he went pee. Oh my <laughs> god, that is so funny. Okay, you better not leave wet clothes or anything on the ground. Just leave no. it. We'll get it. Um, did you want to put him away for now? Yeah. Or bring him upstairs? Yeah. Or have Abby? Oh my gosh, that is so funny, you guys. Okay, anyway, so we have this paper. I'm just going to give this a burnish here with our bone folder. I love our bone folders. They're so nice. Um, I use it pretty much for everything. This one here I've had forever and a day, and I use it to um, refill our ink pads, and it works just slick, and then I wipe it off, and you know, it's all good. All right, so for the front, as you can see on here, I have white for the base. Now, what I did is I cut um, two of the, um, oh goodness, what is it called, the evergreen. What is it called? I, I'm drawing a blank right now. Um, our new in color. And I wasn't sure if I wanted to use that one or if I wanted to use the white. And I'm kind of thinking I might want to use the white just because it'll pop a little bit more. Yeah, I'm thinking I might like that. What do you guys think? I think that looks better. What do you think? So this is, what is this called, this green? Do you remember offhand? Forest? Evening Evergreen. Evening Evergreen, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm kind of thinking I'm going to go with the white just because it kind of gets lost in the background on that card. So we're going to go ahead and use the white pieces. Now those two <laughs> pieces measure um, two and a quarter by three and three fourths. And then the designer series paper that we're going to put on top of it is two by three and a half. So we're going to go ahead and get those on. Yeah, the darker of the two is Evening Evergreen. I gotta get those n names down. I still don't have them down. Soft Succulent, Evening Evergreen. I'm gonna turn that over because I kinda got it stuck. What's this do? What happens when I do this? I don't know. Ooh. Your goal prompt was sent. We'll see what happens. Uh -oh, I just I hope we're trying we didn't... to get 900 followers. Hey, you could so, share it to that one group. Please make sure that you're uh, following us so that way you can stay up to date with all the good things that are happening. Absolutely. All the crafting stuff. Renee said white. <laughs> I agree. 
All right. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to put a little bit of adhesive, maybe about an inch to an inch and a half. And I'm going to lay that right on top. Now I'm not going to put it all the way across. I'm just going to put it on the right hand side. And I'm just kind of eyeballing where I want this to lay. Okay. So now we have this side adhered on. Now we're going to take and glue just this side onto this panel over here. So again, we're going to go about, I don't know, maybe an inch to two inches, not even. We're going to line this up do, 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 like that. Now our card will open like that. All right, so now for the front, I wasn't quite sure what I wanted to do for the closure. Um, being that we don't have the ovals, I did find some other ones that I thought would be kind of fun to, to use. We could use this one that way, Ooh. or we could use it this way. Kind of like it tall. The tall way? Mm -hmm. That's different. Or we oh. could bring in, yeah, That's no, different. no, it's different. <laughs> I like it. Too otherwise, small. Otherwise, I wouldn't have cut it out. Mm. So, you Too know. small. Or we got one of these. Mm. So what do you guys think? We got the small one. You kind of, do you want to go up a little bit oh, more? Oh, am there I down? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. The small one. Or Kayla likes this one going that way. That's kind of cool. I'm a fan of that one. You're a fan of that one? Or we could use this one. You guys tell me what you think. Um, let me see here. What do I have? I think it for... kind of depends on the stamp set. Bernie said rounded big. So I think she's the on rounded the same big one, one as okay. me. All right. So we're thinking that one. Now, I do have some ribbon we can use with this as well. Ooh, that would be pretty. That's the evening evergreen. This is evening evergreen. Uh-huh. Or we've got the... Do, 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 if I can find it. Ooh, this would be even pretty. This color is that mint with gold. That Thanks, even, Mary Ellen. That might even work, too. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Got three greens going on with that one. Um, let's see. Do, 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 do. Um, let's <laughs> see. Well, you just here. Sorry, I couldn't. Okay. I couldn't find the ribbon. The soft succulent. Okay, the soft succulent. That might be a little too light. Yeah, okay. I would go with the evening evergreen. Go with the dark one. Mm -hmm. Okay, jokey. I'm that a fan. sounds good. Okay, so stamp set. The one that I used was the color and contours. Now we can use that one as well. Um, I think we could use we could use this pretty this pretty flower and <laughs> Pam, probably... Pam said did you get your kitty yes we, we did I showed him relatively at the beginning of this video so you could always rewind a couple minutes once the replay is done or live when we're not yeah. live um, but he <laughs> He just went pee in a plastic bag behind us, so I brought him back upstairs uh, to his kitty litter. He's never done that before, so. Yeah, that was funny. He, all I, of a sudden, he went, meow. I wonder if he like, had a UTI. Oh, did did they, they check know. for that? They they checked him, and. Do they check for Maybe that? he felt bad because he was going potty in no, the No, because he does bag. that before he pees. You told every me time. he only did it when he. When no, anytime he goes to the bathroom. But I asked you, and you said he yeah. only did it. Well, both. Oh. Yeah. Now you tell me. After so. we saw the vet yesterday. That's okay. Okay, so I am going to get a scrap piece of paper somewhere. Um, We're just going to take printer paper. Printer paper. Because it's really close to me right here. Yes, our little boy. He is quite the munchkin. Melanie loves the evening evergreen ribbon. It's pretty. It is very pretty. Okay, so let's go ahead and I'm going to do this up in the evergreen. He was scared. Yeah, I think so. He's not, he wasn't used to this area. He's explored it a little bit, but um, wasn't super impressed, I think. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> he didn't care. I'm like, eh. 
Okay, so there we have that. Um, <laughs> what color should I put? You know what, I think I'm gonna add, a, I'm gonna try this and see what happens. I'm gonna add a little bit of the, the pale papaya. We're gonna take the inside, which is this one right here, and we're gonna stamp on the inside. See if this will work. Oh, I'm sorry, that was probably really loud. <laughs> <laughs> Pam said, I'll definitely watch the replay so I can see him. He is a sweetie. Um, he, when he cuddles, he cuddles hard. He loves cuddling when he, he sleeps. He really is a cuddler. It's just crazy. I haven't let him loose in my room yet because I'm too scared to. Overnight. Anyhow. Overnight. Yeah, I mean, he is loose um, during the day until he gets used to the bigger boys and they get used to him, but ooh, ooh that's pretty. That is really pretty. Um, I, he, so he sleeps in his kennel and we put like a little soft enclosed cushion A little thing, bed. He's bed. got a little bed. <laughs> and it's in there and he was meowing when we were, he was, when we were going to bed and like he went he didn't fall asleep until I put my fingers in the cage so he Aww. had human touch. <laughs> That is so sweet. It is really sweet. He's okay. a good kitty. All right, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to leave the flower like that. And um, for the inside, we're going to stamp um, in a minute here. But what did I do with the ribbon? Oh, here it is. Sorry. I'm losing my marbles here. <laughs> I suppose I could put that there. Yeah, I think we'll do that. So what I'm going to do, of course, you guys know I am very challenged when it comes to bows. If you don't know that about me, you're going to learn now. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to wrap. Whoops, wrong way. I'm going to wrap this around this way. And I'm going to take the stickiness off of it because this is going to be the bottom part. I'm going to show you here. This is a funky card. This is turning out funky. It is. Okay. So we're going to go like that. I wasn't expecting you to take it this way. You weren't, huh? No, I wasn't. What were you expecting? Uh, not orange. It's it's pale. Yeah, Papaya. but it's orange. Yeah, but don't. It'll be cute. It'll be cute. Oh, you know what? I could have done soft succulent. That probably would have been better. You know. <laughs> Okay, now you got me thinking. I like I like okay. a good monochrome monochrome okay. card. That's what we'll do then. I, I think that would be. It'll take two seconds to do that. Die cut it out. I'm gonna do two of these actually. In the basic white. Yes, very good idea. Yeah. Thanks, Ladon. Don't forget you can thumbs up this video if you are on Facebook with us live. You should see your name come across the screen. Hi, Jill. Hi, Roxanne. Welcome Hello. to the party. To the party. Just showed my kitty for those of you who are just joining. And he so, peed on TV. Uh, he did. Well, actually, I didn't see him, but. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, is he going potty? He was. <laughs> I guess that, that's what we get for waking him up in the middle of a nap. Because he was taking a nap. So, okay, so we are using these dies. These are the Stitch So Sweetly dies. These are like my go to. Um, that I have been using for a lot of things. Okay, so now we're gonna do this stamping all over again. Forget about that uh, pale papaya. We're gonna get our image back up. And I didn't clean it off because I have no idea where I put my, my um, you know, that thing, that purple thing, that squeegee thing that Kayla likes to call it. Shammy? Yeah. Mm. That was hard. Yeah, it was. Really hard words. Okay, so we're going to go like this with our evening evergreen. And I'm going to take that off. We're going to take this. And I'm going to grab our soft succulent. I'll post a picture of him in our exclusive group so you guys can see him. Absolutely. Got some better pictures of him. Oh we got like probably 500 from at least from the moment that we got him. Yeah. He's so cute. Okay, we're just going to pop this over here. All right. Wow, that looks really dark. 
Hmm. Could have stamped off one. I could have. <laughs> yes, I could. Or that attitude and that I look could've. that you just I know. gave me. It almost looks like evening evergreen, though, doesn't it? It does. What the hey? What the hey? What the hey? You got too juicy of a pad there. I think I do. Wow, you guys. Flip it over. Hmm. The stitches will be a yeah, little different. Yeah, I think I'll do that. Oh, okay. Because it's driving me bonkers. You're bonkers? It's going to drive me bonkers uh -oh. if I don't take care of it. All right. Let's see. What did I do with that thingy again? That thingy? That thingy. That's very descriptive. I know, right? It probably would help if I had the cleaning pad. But, all right, we're going to do this again. And this time we're going to stamp off. Because I thought for sure it would have been a softer color with the so suck in it. Mm -hmm. But I don't know what happened. I don't know. Okay. Stamp off once? Yes. So second gen. Second generation stamping here, guys. Let's see what happens. I'll get it right sooner or later. There's one. Ooh, Lisa says she likes the pale papaya one. And there's two. Wow. I guess that'll do. I think that looks more like soft succulent. Yeah, not a very good impression. Could be because of my stamp. Could be. Could be. All right, so there we have it. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a this, and I'm going to go like this. Uh, yep, I got it. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's all good. Is it? Trust me. Trust the process. Okay. Trust the process. Are you putting somebody behind it? Yes, I am. Oh, look that's at you. That's why I cut two of them. Oh, I see. Mm -hmm. I see. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're going to put this back here so I can put a faux bow on here. Faux bow. My faux bow. We're going to put this and align it up. So I cut two of them. And I'm going to put that there. Okay. Uh-huh. And then we're going to put it on here. Okay. We're only going to put tape from here up. Okay. Do I need to zoom in a little bit for you guys? You look kind of far away. It does look a little far away, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. Okay. So now I'm just going to kind of remember where I put my tape and make sure Ooh, I line it up. There we go. A little better. Okay. And there we have that. Now I'm going to take... I need my bow maker. Where is my bow maker? I do not know where the bow maker is, so guess what? How are you going to make a bow if you don't have your bow maker? I'm going to do a bow. Somehow. Mm -hmm. We'll see how it turns out. Oh. This ribbon actually is very nice to, to tie into ribbons, so... You'd be surprised. It shouldn't be that difficult. However, it is I. <laughs> Karen's so late. Oh no, Karen. Just kidding. It's okay. <laughs> oh, thanks, Yvonne. She goes, you two are hilarious. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. So not too bad, Kayla. What do you think? Not too bad. Oh, that's a good bow. I think so. That's a pretty good bow. Not too bad. First try. I know, right? Okay, so I'm just cutting those straight, and we'll just add this down here for a little bit of, little bit of sass, a frass. Okay, so now we're just going to take our glue dot. Do do do. Okay. So I'm going to set this up so Kayla can take pictures of these right away, and I can work on. Um, the blog post. Okay? okay, so we have that. Now, don't go away yet. I'm going to add some blank. <laughs> Pam no. can't tie a bow either. <laughs> Vicky said, awesome bow. Great job. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Okay, so we have... Mm -mm. Ooh, I like the... This one? That genial. One? Yep. The genial ones? Yep. Okay. G genial gems? The genial gems. Okay, hold on. I gotta find my pokey tool. Here is our take your pick tool. I'm just gonna add a couple of these. 
Now Kayla's probably gonna say, why aren't you using that? Because I don't know, I like to do things the hard way. So, yeah. Hmm. Okay, there we go, there's our one card. Oh, that's cute. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna actually go on the inside now, and I'm just gonna stamp real quick. Um, just uh, at your absolutely amazing right here. I like that one because it's good for just about everything. Thank you. I you're am pretty amazing. amazing, right? Thank you for all that you're, you do. No. You're pretty amazing. No. No. I'm not? No. Maybe. Ah, uh, yeah, I am. Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay, here we go. There we go. You're absolutely amazing. So that is fun fold number one. Just winging it today. Now you certainly could leave this um, this fun thing off. Um, you could do something like this. Do a little flower up in the corner and do a little bit of... Karen says she does gems the same way with the pokey end. For me, it just seems so much easier. Aw, thanks Pam. Okay. She goes, I think you're both amazing. Aww. Aww. That's, That's so sweet. sweet. <laughs> Uh, Lisa said I struggle with bows, but I can never remember how to use my bow maker. Really? Oh my gosh, I've gotten to be a pro at it. Oh my gosh, I love it. Thank I God for Vicky. I just remember the number four. Yep. Because you make a number four. Exactly. Like you, go, you have your two ends, you go up and over, or up, over, and under. Then you make a number four, and you tie the knot. That's it. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Easy peasy. You're good. Oh, thanks. That was really good. Okay, so next we're gonna do this card here. We're gonna do it with the hand pen paper. And of course we're gonna do it in purple. I just had to try it in purple. Isn't that gorgeous? I absolutely love it. And then of course we have this side, but oh, yum. All right, so what you're gonna need, I kind of wrote down the measurements back here. Card base is gonna be four and a quarter by five and a half. Okay, and then that's gonna be in our Gorgeous Grape. The second piece in Gorgeous Grape measures three and a quarter by four and a quarter, and that's gonna be a mat. Um, the mat that I'm talking about here that measures four by five and a quarter, we're gonna be embossing this one with the Stitch Greenery. Hi everyone, welcome. Oops. Wow. Hello. Hello. <laughs> welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, we took a designer series paper piece that measures four by six, and then we're going to score it at three, which I've already done ahead of time. Now, it doesn't matter what side you put on the outside. Um, it's just kind of fun for you to have something fun when you pop it, pop, pop, poop it open. Pop it pop. open. Pop it open. Pop. And um, since I'm going with grape and Highland Heather on the outside, I thought it would be a nice little fun surprise on the inside um, with the flowers. Um, you're going to need a designing series, or excuse me, basic white that measures two and three fourths by three and three fourths, and then you're going to need a scrap for a die. But however, ahead of time, I've already die cut a scrap um, from a scrap piece. Um, this piece right here. So we are going to get started now. This. I love this stitch greenery. Oh my gosh. This it is just... cool. Okay, y'all are probably like, if you look at this in the catalog or online, you're like, this is expensive. It is. But is really pretty. It's really worth it because it is so gorgeous. And I like this because it's very subtle. It is. It and really the is. subtle embossing folder is gone. You can see that right back here. You can move it a little bit so they can see the front a little. No. <laughs> But tilt, I'm, I'm, I know, can see but it in tilt there. it around so then they can see it all like that. the way around. Yeah, yeah. Okay. There you go. <laughs> okay. But the subtle embossing folder is gone, which was one of my favorites, and this kind of has taken the place I of it. I like that one. Yeah. So if you were a fan of the subtles, this one you'd be surprised. Um, so I'm gonna run this through our machine real quick, and this embossing. Um, or this embossing, the stamp and embossed machine. I love it. It is so awesome. We've had it now for over a year and 
it, it, it's just, oh, I just love it. Just love it. What am I doing? This is a die, not an embossing folder. So since this is a die, we're going to need um, plate number one, two, one of the threes. We're going to put our die down and then our piece of paper. And then we're going to put the top number three over it. Okay. And it is a little bit of a tight one, but we can get her through. There we go. Can you guys believe it's June? God. I can't believe it. It just, yeah, things are just flying by. Okay, so that's the back side. We're going to gently peel this off, maybe. If I can grab it. There we go. All right. You see that? Wow, look at that. Isn't that, that is awesome? Really pretty. I love it. And it Seriously. doesn't cut it, it just kind it, of punctures it. Yep, it's like someone took and did, um, you know, the quilting patterns on here. It, it's just gorgeous. All right, so here we go. We're going to add this piece onto our card base. And what's really nice is sometimes when you do embossing, um, the it's really hard to get the embossing folder or the embossed piece to stick and I have no problems with this sticking whatsoever. Really? Yeah, it, it sticks really nice. Well, I suppose because it doesn't like... It's not really buckled, it, it just pierces the paper. Oh my goodness, that's so pretty. Look at that. <laughs> Uh, hey, look, it matches my shirt. Lisa said, I can't believe it's 2021. I know, right? Jill says it needs to be fall. Summer sucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. Vicki said, will Charlie be going to the lake with you guys? Uh, possibly all the cats. <laughs> yes, I'm pretty sure. Oh, my dad's going to love it. I roll my eyes on I that one. I don't know if it's no. a good idea or not. <laughs> no, he was with us last, uh, this past weekend. And, and we, Charlie was. Just Charlie. Yeah. We left the other two, but um, yeah, we'll probably end up bringing both of them, or all of them, excuse me. So now that I have directional paper on the inside, I just want to pay attention to where it's going. Um, on this paper, I guess it doesn't really matter too much, but flowers grow up, so I'm going to stick with that. So on this side, we're going to add adhesive. And I get a little crazy with this tape. I don't really need to, but it's a good, strong adhesive. So you don't really need quite as much as what I'm using. I love this purple. It's All so right. pretty. So there we have that. Now we're going to open this up. I'm going to put this on the inside. Now, I probably won't um, write anything or stamp anything in here yet. Um, especially on this one, just because with thank yous, I like to write a little bit more. So, we'll go ahead and adhere this. All right, so there we have that. And now we're going to grab our little piece that I took out earlier. And I think we'll probably just stick with the same things. And the thanks that I used was this one here from Artistically Ink. You could always put um, Happy Birthday would probably fit. Uh, almost. <laughs> Hi, Jean. Hmm. Bernice, a perfect choice of paper. Um, Jill, she said, did I miss seeing the new kitty? Yes. yes. We had to bring him back upstairs because he, <laughs> he peed in a plastic bag that's on the ground. Yep. Which we're going to clean up after the live. But... Um, we brought him back upstairs. At least he peed in the plastic bag. Yeah, at least he did that, and he knew better. Mm -hmm. And yeah, he's a smart kitty. Um, you can grab him before we leave, <laughs> Vicky, before we sign off. Yeah, Vicky says other two. Don't you mean other three? Or don't you mean the other three? You have four now, correct? We have three. So Max, Indigo, and now Charlie. Blue is with my coworker. Michael, we had to re um, we rehomed him, and he's getting a lot of love oh. and a lot of attention. He and needs he is spoiled to heck. <laughs> yeah, he is spoiled, and he's very happy. Um, it was getting to be where he was attacking um, sleeping cats in the house, and he needed he needed to be the only cat, basically. So. Um, uh, 
Kayla's friend, co-worker, mm -hmm. ended up taking them, and it has been a blessing. We are so, so happy Yeah. Um, where he's at now. Vicki said, I love this purple also. Okay, Hi, guys. Terry. I'm going to go with this, um, this, uh, what is it Hey, called? you're matching. I, I know, right? Um, this gorgeous grape sheer ribbon. Pretty sure that's gorgeous grape. Yep. Gorgeous grape. You know you have glasses on your head, right? I know I do. <laughs> but, you know, <laughs> why wear them? I mean, that would just be too simple. All right, now I'm really going to miss my bow maker that I got from Vicki because that bow I made here turned out gorgeous with the bow maker. All right, so here we go again. Faux bow right here. A little bit of tape and a little bit there. I'm going to put some of this around here and we're going to go like that. Ooh, that's pretty. Yeah. I love the purple. That's going to be a pretty, really striking Even though on this, on this card, isn't this a cool combo like the pale papaya and rich raspberry? Like I would not have thought to put those two together. I'm yeah, a fan. I like that. I like that. Okay, so dimensionals. Of course, we gotta have dimensionals. Terry says, "I love the gorgeous grape ribbon." I know it's awesome. It's number one on mom's list. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous. It's gorgeous. Um, this one is absolutely stunning. I could have used this one as well, but it is a little bit thicker, and um, I didn't want to go over our words on here, so. Mm -hmm. um, that's why I went with the smaller one. Yeah. And anything you see can always be bought this way, Kayla. Um, Are you looking over here too? Online store, <laughs> uh, stampybay.com forward slash shop. Uh, it'll bring you to the website where you can purchase any of this product. Okay, how many? How many? Online. How many? Uh, two, four, six, eight. Eight dimensional. Not too bad. Not, not I have too to, shabby. I have to start playing catch up because, boy, I tell you, I really haven't been using dimensionals. You haven't. Very much lately. So I've been creating a lot of flat cards. That's not fun. I have to stop doing that. You do. <laughs> what is wrong with you? What's going on? <laughs> What's going on? Got okay. Michael, Bol Michael Bolton, right? It's the song, What's Going On? What's going on? No? No. Marvin oh, Gaye? Mar Marvin Gaye, but isn't... Um, no, it's... It's... Uh, oh, hmm. wait, wait, wait. What's going on? No. Hmm. No? Michael... Where was <laughs> Michael Bolton? You're so funny. What's going on? Yeah, it is. Which one? Um, What's going on? Hold on, guys. Here, I'm trying to do this without my bow maker because I don't know where I placed it. <laughs> oh, I have the volume down. Oh, I almost oh, that's blasted the music. Oh, that would not have been good. Oh, yeah. That's a Marvin Gaye song. It's a remake. What's going on? Okay, I have to stop before they, we get copyrighted and they take our audio They're going to take our video away. We'll get blocked from... Hi, Carol. Okay, this is a really sad looking bow. <laughs> Vicki goes, do you need another bow maker? I can bring it to Cheryl's garage sale yeah. tomorrow. <laughs> Honestly, it's around here somewhere. It's somewhere. Oh, guess what? I found it. Right Yay. next to her. <laughs> it was hiding. Okay. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I love this bow maker. Got Seriously. It. So, you... Well, how do you use this okay. real quick? So I do the left. So you have your ribbon. And I always leave mine on the on the bolt. But it's um, the left, right over left. Or no. Yep. I can't, I, I just do it when I when I do it here. Okay, it's so the right, right over, left. over the left. And then you take your, your left piece, bring it your up. Your right piece. And, bring, and over. Your now right piece. Your now right piece. And then you make a four. And bring it through. And tie a knot. And tie a knot. And you can move this around. And ta-da. Actually, yeah. I fudged that one really up. really ugly bow. That turned out really ugly. <laughs> it's because I was going slow and I was thinking about it. You know, actually, it's not that bad. 
Okay, hold on. Let's give this a whirl again. This over here. This over here. It's not that ugly. It could be the ribbon, too. Because some ribbons are just, can be. Some little, don't like to make the ears. Yeah, yeah. So, this one, it looks like. Yeah, this, okay. I'm going to try it one more time. If that doesn't work, then we're just going to go with it. Maybe. Nope, I'm not going to open it up bigger. All right. This ribbon, it's uh, its this ribbon. When you tie it, it kind of moves. Um, the sides move. It's not <laughs> quite as thick on the ends right here as this one. So it it's easy to... Manipulate <laughs> Lisa it. goes, you make it look so easy. <laughs> okay, see now look at that. See, yep, okay. I'm going to go with my first bow. Where did that one go? I think this one turned out better. And that's just because of the, the ribbon itself. It's not the maker. It could be operator air, but I think it's just the way the ribbon is. It, um, it moves a little bit more. It has a little bit more give. So, where did I put the glue dots? Here we go. All right, guys, I think we are almost done with this one. Yay. Oh, <laughs> no, yay yet. Glue dot does help. All right, there we go. Ta da! I have no idea what clips are. Okay, now. Video clipping. What? Better than my bows, Kay what's, said. <laughs> what's a clip, Kayla? Oh, I, I ex now I have left LaDawn's comment up. <laughs> Vicky said, beautiful card. Aww. Thanks, Vicky. Thank you. Oh. I like purple. So does Vicky. Vicky, it's one of her favorite colors. Yep. All right, so we're just going to put a couple of these on here as well. I mean, because we can, then why not? Um, if you are trying to order these, uh, um, these, these beautiful, um, the in color jewels. Oh my God, they're beautiful. They're so shiny. Put this back in here. They are absolutely gorgeous. They're sold out right now. Um, they're on back order. So if you try to place an order, you probably won't be able to get them right now. Um, but they will be back in stock shortly. Um, so yeah. That's it. That's it for these cards, you guys. Wow, that was really fast. I mean, not real. I two cards in forty. It's pretty three minutes. See what happens when I have things planned and you know, just had to cut the stuff ahead of time. Yeah, I tell you. All right, so there we have it for these cards. I do. This I like is it. this is my favorite. That's because it's yeah. purple. It's because it's purple. I like this one. I'm a fan of this one because it's fun color combo. Yep. Color combo this one I we did. Seen. This is the one that we did with our team. And then this is a, a rendition of it. And then, of course, the inside. You're absolutely amazing. Amazing. Carol said pretty cards. Jean said gorgeous awesome. card. Yes, Highland Heather and Gorgeous Grape are my favorite colors. Aren't they pretty? Oh, my gosh. So pretty. So, so pretty. <laughs> All right. I think that's it. Oh. Oh. Do we have? Oh, yep. Oh, we've got oh, we Ginny's got, winner. We got to get that in the mail. So Ginny, it. your winner from last week. Yeah. Um, we have it right here. It's Sorry, get mailed. I was sitting down. <laughs> My feet got sore. Oh, <laughs> uh, hi. <laughs> What's up? How are you hi. doing? <laughs> uh, so that's kind of the cards we have for you. Okay, now um, you're going to do your talk. Should I go get the baby? Yeah, if you want to. Okay, go I'll go get it. the baby while you do your talk. Yeah, I see the baby again. Um, babe, Kitty cat uh not an actual child not, not a human uh but please make sure you're following us and uh that way you get to know us a little bit more um you'll see our videos more frequently and all the projects that we do we also have an exclusive facebook group so make sure to go over there and join that i will link the comments that or link that group in the comments um but we post uh, exclusive tutorials over there all the time, and we post uh, fun interactive kind of interactive posts when we can. Uh, so we did like a word search recently, which was fun. I made that. That was so fun. Um, maybe we'll have to do another one in the 
near future. But I wanted to show uh, some things with you before we get going. Uh, Paper Pumpkin, if you're not subscribed to Paper Pumpkin, you are missing out. I love Paper Pumpkin. It's a monthly kit that's sent out to your house or wherever you want it to every month and it includes all the supplies you need to make cards. And so the next Paper Pumpkin is going to be Expressions in Color, which will come with two Stampin' Spots, which are the small inks that come with it. And when you do that, you'll get um, our exclusive tutorials of six different projects in it. Um, I'll pause here because mom's got a little, little boy who doesn't seem too happy. Oh, <laughs> Charlie! I woke him up. Oh, again? He was he was snuggling oh. with Andy and oh. on your bed, and he was petting him. So. He's so tiny, you guys. Yes, he he's the smallest cat. I should put I him by a seen. card so they can see. Yeah, you put the him. size. Or this is a cat card. Well, <laughs> <laughs> matches with mom. This is the size of a card. <laughs> He's just and a that's little, him. That's a little bit bigger than He's like, card. what is that? I don't understand. He's, yeah, just very small. Very. He's um, a, he, he weighs a pound and a half. Oh, they weighed him? Yeah, they did. I forgot Charlie to tell you. He weighs one and a half pounds. Mm-hmm. Oh, Charlie. Mm -hmm. You're so tiny. <laughs> he's like, well, yeah, I'm just yeah. a newborn. He's he's very sweet. He was eight. He's eight weeks old. He turned eight weeks on Sunday. So he's like, what the heck are you doing? <laughs> oh. Wow. Huh? <laughs> but he's a purebred Siberian forest cat. They're hypoallergenic. Um, and a lot of people get them because they're hypoallergenic. And they become very big cats. They're a middle see? to large size cat. Um, one of the largest cats out there. So he'll be a big boy, even though he's tiny right now. And it's all because of Max, our first cat, that yeah. we fell in. Fell in love with. Fell so. in love. <laughs> He's just looking at her. This is so sweet, you guys. Uh, <laughs> oh my He's gosh, so okay, I'm so okay, distracted so now. Distracted. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, make sure you're subscribed to Paper Pumpkin. Um, hit is great. It's one of my favorite things in the world. Now next to that cat. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, wow, gosh, don't forget we have the... Um, last chance products for the January to June mini catalog and so that is going to be uh, retiring at the end of this month Bring them up real quick. okay uh, that's going to be retiring at the end of this month so let me see here I'm gonna pull this website up for you to see and I'll also put in the chat transition so on our website, we have um, the Last Chance products where you could see you don't really need this anymore. The annual catalog is already retired. But you could download kind of the retirement and Last Chance products for the mini catalog. It's going to show up in an Excel spreadsheet. So that's stampingbay.com slash retiring hyphen list. I'll put it in the chat too so you guys have that. But I wanted to let you know about that because... Uh, if you don't, oh my video wasn't showing down there in the bottom, but if you don't get some of your favorite products from that catalog, um, you gotta do it now while supplies last, cause they'll be gone. Um, yeah. Oh, product of the month. Uh, so it's a new month, and so this month we are giving away, I don't know if mom pulled them out, I'm very confused on what they are. What are, what's the product of the month? I don't know what oh. they're called because I don't even know what they look like. Here, they're right here. Okay. Oh, oh now God, you have another, another cat. I have a different cat. <laughs> they're right here. It's the Shaker Shapes. And so we're going to be giving away packets or the whole container of these. I'll show you here on the table. But these will be with any purchase that you make with us in the month Ooh, of... Yeah. What? Good luck opening it. It's going to go flying everywhere. Oh. These are going to be uh, in the month Ooh, of good girl. <laughs> June. Any purchase you make with us online, these are fun, especially if you make like shaker cards. If you got the sprinkles from the ice cream, the ice cream yeah. from the ice cream suite, they're very much the same texture. Very fun. Very pretty. 
Um, and you could always add glue dots on the back of these or some Tombow glue and add them to the front of cards, too. I could play with these all Indigo the time. Indigo was like, wow, let me have that. I'll have that. I'll have at it. Um, so, any purchase, the month of June, that's what you uh, will end up getting. And I think that's it. I don't know why this is red now. I'm, like, distracted by it. Anyway, <laughs> that's all you guys are staring at now. I know yeah, it. Yeah, they are. <laughs> Um, I think that's it. Oh, if your purchase is over $50, then you, um, get, hi, you get <laughs> our loyalty rewards, which event eventually gets you a free stamp set of your choice. So I recommend doing that. And what else? I think, I think that's, that's it. Yeah, I, I think, think that's about it. it you did really good. Well, thanks. Oh, wait. I was running around. You gotta get oh. my waist off. Yes. Hello. Most important part. Hello, what? you guys. <laughs> Nancy, leave again and come back with a different cat. I know. <laughs> hey, I could. Yeah. We got the third one over here. I don't know <laughs> why our camera does this. It, What's like, wrong? It glitches out. Now it's not doing it. But this oh. is Indigo. He's not even a year old and he's ginormous. He is going to be, yeah, he's almost he's a year. He's almost a year old in like a week. Yep. Yeah. Right? He's a doing baby. Okay. Um, Giveaway. Yay! Give away! Awesome! Uh, Cindy goes, cute kitties! Oh okay. my gosh. So, today we are going to be giving away a free tutorial from our website, which I have not updated yet because I've been busy, but I will update it for our winner. <laughs> um, <laughs> I will update it for our winner, and then you guys all have our updated stuff on our website, too. But... We are giving away for a free tutorial on our website, and so that's where if you go to, hold on, let me pull up the drum roll with sound effect, sound effect thingy before we get there. Um, but <laughs> our video is going to disappear for a second, but we're still here. Oh, here. Um, are they seeing double, or is that just us? That's just us. So. Okay. If you're on our website, you'll get a pop-up that comes up. You can put your email in here and subscribe to our newsletter. But when you go to our website, click on Create It Yourself. All of our free, tu not all of our free, all of our tutorials are on here. We also have our free PDFs for our DSP samplers that you could choose. Does not include the DSP, unfortunately. But all of these classes to go, all of our tutorial bundles that we've done in the past, you can always find on our website. So we're going to be giving one of these away to a lucky winner. Mm -hmm. And they get to choose what they want. Mm -hmm. They get to choose, like, I want this tutorial. So, Here we go. our winner, let me get the drum roll going. Are you guys ready? Drum roll emojis. Ready? There it is. Oh, that was really quiet. That was. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, oh. Terry Johnstone. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, Terry. Congratulations. Congrats. Um, please just message us so then we can get you the tutorial and we'll have uh, next steps on what you can do to get that tutorial. We'll probably give you a little um, code that you can use to download them. Awesome. Um, and yeah, then we can get that off to you free of what's, charge. What's for participating this week? What do they do? For get? this week. It's a baby. That's really exciting. This is in the new catalog, right? Mm-hmm. We ordered double accidentally. So it's a benefit for you guys. So <laughs> uh -huh. we are going to be giving away next Wednesday the best year stamp set with all of these awesome sentiments in here. Happy Father's Day. Warm wishes for a happy Christmas. You did it. Hello. Mm -hmm. There was a cat that ran between my legs. <laughs> uh, I wish that was a sentiment. Brand new. <laughs> Brand new. It's still never been used. We just ordered double. So um <laughs> Lisa, I come here for the cards, but I stay for the cats. And you guys. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. That's funny. Uh, um, but we'll give you, be giving this away. All you have to do is interact in this video in some way. Say, oh, my gosh, you have a cute cat. Or say hi. Or say where you're from. All that kind of stuff. Absolutely. Interact in this video. And I will uh, choose a winner next week. But you got to make sure you come back and hang out with us next week on... Wednesday. Because we got to get this stuff away. 7 p.m. Central Time. That mm -hmm. means you have to come back and claim it. Mm-hmm. 
do it. Make sure your mess is just, it doesn't matter if you're a demonstrator or not, you still win. Yep. So. That's it. The only thing that matters is if you're in the United, United States or oh, not. Oh, yeah. Because we got, it's just a legal thing. We yeah. can't send things. But Jill goes, I'm not surprised you guys ordered doubles. <laughs> We're a mess. We can't remember anything. Yeah, Jill's got us nailed. Um, so, Jill. Yeah. I think one month we sent her like four of the same prize. Pro pro yeah, you know, uh, the pro for, yeah, it was not good. It was. We were like, I sent one, mom sent one, then I sent one again. <laughs> and then somehow she got another one. Yes, and what is God. happening? <laughs> we need to keep track of stuff better. Oh, gosh. Oh, we're doing good, though. Yeah. We're doing good. Yeah. Okay, you guys. <laughs> well, thanks so much for hanging out with us. It was awesome, as always. We love hanging out with you. We do. Um, and if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us. As always, you can shop any of the crafting supplies you saw us working with, all Stampin' Up. You can shop with us online, stampybay.com forward slash shop, and it will give you directions on how to shop with us. <laughs> Gosh, this video is slow. Do you see this? That's so weird. I don't know why it does that. Okay, anyway. I'm so fighting. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, everyone. We'll see you next week. Take bye. care. Bye-bye.